back to the channel so i've been using ios 14 on my iphone 6s here for about a week now and it's very unstable as you can see this is ios 14 and the build number that comes with this version has a v at the end and that basically means that it's highly unstable usually a represents the highest stability and the lower you go down the chain the less stable that build is so v is like on the bottom bottom end of stability and i've been experiencing quite a number of issues on my iphone 6s it's sometimes video won't call if i receive a facetime call nothing shows up everything blacks out and i want to show you a simple fix you know if your phone is experiencing such issues and also if it's like experiencing some sort of seizure so the first thing that i noticed that helps when you are running ios 14 on an old device like this iphone 6s is to basically not run a lot of applications especially those those ones that are heavy duty apps so avoid having multiple applications open in the background as that is a bit heavy on the device so that's the first thing you can do so run at about just two application and that should be okay and also something else that helps is clearing the ram memory from time to time so how you clear the ram memory on the iphone 6s is very simple you just basically hold your power button down until you get this slide to switch off option and then once that is there just hold the home button until this basically takes you back to the home screen and i noticed to ios 14 it takes you to the lock screen so just hold down your home button until it unlocked and as you can see it's brought us back to the lock screen so our ram memory has been cleared and you might notice after unlocking your phone that you know the applications that you had open will remain open however if you resume activity in those applications it reloads data indicating that you know whatever was stored in the ram memory has been cleared and the data is being reprocessed again so that's another one fix that you can do clearing the ram and i noticed that that helps pre long the seizure or the glitches that come with ios 14 on the iphone 6s worst case scenario if clearing the ram doesn't work for you what you can simply do is just to switch off the device and wait for about 10 to 30 seconds and then power the device back on and that for me has always worked so just hold the power button and it's very simple you know how to switch off an iphone obviously so just switch it off wait for about 10 to 30 seconds and once your device has completely shut off you can always restart the device and that helps with all the seizures and all the bugs and issues that are coming on ios 14 so usually the bugs reappear after about a day or two and i find that just by clearing the ram that helps a lot and can prolong that period and that's something simple that i thought i should share i'm thinking of perhaps doing a video where i revert this iphone 6s to ios 13 and let me know in the comment section if you'd like to see such a video and if it's your first time watching on this particular channel make sure you hit subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of the latest content we have for you if you reach this far into the video thank you very much and if you like the video please leave a like and hit subscribe down below stay safe and i will catch you guys in the next one peace